If I could talk or had money, I'd thank you and tip you. <laughs> the joy of Beatles lasagna, it always puts a smile on our faces. Vito, what happened to you? We're getting to the bottom of this. Wait for me, guys! I'm sorry, Mr. Arbuckle. Sorry, Kitty Cat uh, and the Puppy Dog. I guess Vito has just not been himself lately. Not since she left me. She? Whew. Angelica, the most beautiful woman on the planet. This is the woman who ruined my dinner? She brought out the best in me. The passion I bring to my cooking. Here you are, la mia stella. Pasta alla vito, cooked with love, and also with marinara sauce. Ah, Vito, your cooking is superb. We were so happy until he came into our lives. She met him somewhere and was taken. Brent Mogul. Brent Mogul, the real estate tycoon? The guy who builds all those buildings? He builds buildings, but he destroys your relationships. I will never forget what she said to me. You are very sweet, Vito. But Brent... Brent creates mighty buildings. He creates skyscrapers, and the towers, and the roads, and the mini malls. All you create, Vito, is eggplant parmesan. I go now to be with Brent. Farewell, Vito. Maybe Brent and I will order a pizza some day. After we are married. Nothing has been the same since that day. Not even my lasagna. We know. <laughs> Here, blow that nose of yours before you hurt someone with it. <laughs> Here is the last lasagna I made before she broke my heart. I think you should have it, Kitty Cat. You always loved it so. You'll get over her, Vito. Never! My heart it is a broken! And since I cook with my heart, my cooking, she's a broken too! <sighs> Poor Vito. Be careful with that, Garfield. That could be the last good Vito lasagna you'll ever have. <sighs> Maybe we should get an armored car to take it home. <sighs> Here you go. Enjoy it while you can. Farewell, lasagna, my faithful friend. No, I can't let this be the last Vito's lasagna. I have to find a way to get Vito and Angelica back together. Hmm. Yes! I know how to do it. Come on, Odie. Brent Mogul Real Estate Investments. I'm sorry, Mr. Mogul's in a meeting and can't be disturbed. I'll disturb him. Yeah. I've almost acquired the land necessary for my next project. A city within a city. The city of the future. Ah, Brent, you are amazing. I can't tell you how much I admire all the things you do. Go ahead, try. Hmm. <laughs> You're important. You're a man of the future. You're... Oh, Brent, do you smell lasagna? No. Why? Oh, I was just reminded of someone. Someone kind of sweet. Someone who liked to make me happy. <laughs> 
But never mind him. He's in my past. Are those the plans for the new development? Yeah, looks like we wasted our time. How could she dump Vito for a guy who's just gonna tear down old buildings and put up new ones? Yes, but I'll do better than show you plans. I'll show you the area where we're starting demolition. <gasps> a personal tour for my wife-to-be. <laughs> hey, look, Odie. This is what he's gonna do downtown. Mm. That's West Central Street. So Vito should be right about... Oh, that's odd. Vito should be right there, but there's a tanning salon. <laughs> he's gonna... He's going to get rid of Vito's. Hey, you two shouldn't be in here. All these. I'm locking you two up and calling the pal. Let's not let him do that. Oh. Hey, you come back here. <laughs> Notice how in chase huh? scenes, the guy chasing always yells, you come back here even though no one ever does? Hey, you come back here! You're right. He's gonna catch us unless I do something drastic. Very well. I'm sacrificing you for a good cause. I'll have him seal off the exits and... Placing that building with a store that sells cell phones. But you're opening two cell phone stores in the last block. Hey, <laughs> you can't have too many stores that sell cell phones. I'm thinking of opening cell phone stores inside other cell phone stores. Coming true. Oh, the kitty cat who was such a good customer of my old friend, Vito. Speaking of Vito's restaurant, take a look at this. <laughs> Take down that corner building next! Sorry if they're a little damp, they've been in a dog's mouth. Brent, where's Vito's restaurant on these plans? That little Italian place? Oh, I'm tearing it down. I want this whole block cleared by nightfall! But that's his business, and his life! He's so proud of that restaurant! I'm putting a tanning salon there. Hey, let's knock down that pizza place now. You can't do that. I can do whatever I want. I'm Brent Mogul. I'll even knock it down myself. of the wrecking ball. Andy Gourmand here, reporting live from outside Vito's Pizzeria, where real estate tycoon Brent Mogul is about to tear the place down. Personally. Yahoo! Mr. Mogul! Andy Gourmand here! You've seen me on TV! How can you knock this building down? You don't even own it. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> a minor technicality. I'll buy it tomorrow. I'm tearing it down today. You will not tear down this building, Brent Mogul. You destroyed one love of my life. You will not get to the other. Get out of the way, fella. I'm Brent Mogul. I get what I want, and I want a tanning salon there. One little chef won't stop me. How about one chef and a cartoonist? Then a cat, then a puppy dog. And a nationally famous food critic with his own TV program! Uh, maybe we ought to sort of move. Nothing will stop him. I bet I know who can. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, okay. Maybe I can put my tanning salon somewhere else. Yeah! Oh boy! <laughs> now Angelica and Vito will get back together again. And his cooking will once again be inspired. Angelica! Oh. <laughs> I thought that she was a coming back to me. I thought so too, Vito. I'm sorry. I guess it was just not meant to be. <gasps> Vito's Pizzeria. Hello. Oh? This is Angelica. Would you please send over the best Italian food in the world? And the man who makes it. That smile! Huh? What does it mean? I think it means we're both getting back what we loved and lost. If you will excuse me, gentlemen, Vito feels inspired. <laughs> <laughs>